Hello, Father Kubicki here, and I hope you've been praying for the Synod of Bishops, which has been going on and will end this Sunday. As you know, it's been in the news a lot, and we've been praying for it since last year. In fact, on March 25th, Pope Francis gave us a beautiful prayer for the Synod, and it's not too late to use it. It goes like this, Jesus, Mary, and Joseph, in you we contemplate the splendor of true love. To you we turn with trust. Holy Family of Nazareth, grant that our families too may be places of communion and prayer, authentic schools of the gospel, and small domestic churches. Holy Family of Nazareth, may families never again experience violence, rejection, and division. May all who have been hurt or scandalized find ready comfort and healing. Holy Family of Nazareth, may the Synod of Bishops make us more mindful of the sacredness and inviolability of the family and its beauty in God's plan. Jesus, Mary, and Joseph, graciously hear our prayer, amen. Did you catch those words that Pope Francis used to describe the family, that it's sacred and inviolable? Sacred or holy and inviolable, meaning not to be profaned or defiled, not to be broken. The family is part of God's plan for humanity. It's the way that children are best reared in basic human values and in the faith. In families, spouses learn to love one another as Christ loves them, and children learn how to love as well. So even though the Synod will soon be ending, let's never stop praying for families, okay?